show you how to tell your scarf or shirt is made from real silk. I have a few items to show you. Scarf, few shirts and silk ties. Anytime when I see great deal on internet that I want to buy a new scarf, if pictures are great uh, quality, I'm gonna check silk wave uh, and I'm gonna show you close up how a silk wave should look like. You can also notice color difference. So at the back is slightly pale, but you can see you can still see design and this is on the front is not very big difference. Uh, if you see white color, it's definitely a synthetic fabric, not silk. And when you look on the silk wave, you can see diagonal lines going through silk fabric. And this is also indicator that you are dealing with real silk. The exactly same apply to silk cushion. You can see pattern even inside, slightly pale like before. Yes, it's slightly pale. You can see a little bit white, but it's not pure white and all lines are going diagonally like before you can tell this applies to everything to scarves to shirts and the genuine silk color changes in different angles you can uh, do a few a silk test but only if you have this silk item at home but before buying you can rely only on pictures and this is what i do this is Kamosho shirt. It's a vintage shirt. It looks a little bit Versace, but it's not. And uh, the silk wave lines are also diagonal. Uh, I'm gonna add some pictures so you can see closer pictures. How, and inside you can tell a slight color difference, but not huge. So, like I said before, a genuine silk color changes in different angles. You can do also a few tests. Uh, for example, if you have this fabric at home and if you're able to, to uh, take a few threads from material, you can do burn test and take a few threads from material and burn it. Real silk burns with smell of burnt hair. You can also do wedding ring test. If silk is not very heavy, real silk can be very easy threaded and pulled through wedding ring because uh, silk is naturally flexible and smooth. Artificial silk uh, will fail this test. You can also do touch test. Touch your silk and get good feel for smoothness of it. Really silk is completely smooth to the touch with soft and almost waxy feeling. If you crunch it a bit in your hand, you should hear crunching noise. If we're talking about silk ties, silk wave looks slightly different. This tie is from last season I think yes and this silk looks slightly different lines are going from the top to bottom so it's slightly different than scarves uh, pillows or silk shirts anyway you can always check Kertag this is um, 30 logo Kertag with fabric content so you can tell it's a silk this is vintage tie you can also check Kertag for vintage ties and you can check uh, if your tie is made from real silk. Same applies to scarf. If you are able to check care tag, check also scarf hand rolled edges. This is also a good indicator if your scarf is made from silk. And my last item is Jenny Versace Couture vintage shirt. There also no silk waves are going diagonally. You can also notice in this shirt I have hidden seams, hidden buttons, small buttons near collar, but this uh, applies to vintage shirt. And when you check inside uh, near collar, there is almost no color difference at all, probably because of bright colors. Uh, so this is also a great indicator. This is real silk. You should also check care tags if uh, care tags still present.
I hope this video helped you a bit and now you know how to find great silk deal online. Thank you for watching, subscribe and see you next time.